and today I want to show you how to display your NFTs in your Decentraland. So here's uh, the builder and we've got one parcel land here and I built uh, a shop or an art gallery whatever you want to call it and all these frames here are what contain my NFTs that you'll see when you jump into Decentraland. So I'm going to show you on the right hand side here to get one of those frames you just scroll down a little bit so you see gallery it's under the category gallery and you scroll down a little bit again and all these purple items uh, they're smart items so that means they can do things and here's the one we're looking for NFT picture frame and what it does is it'll show your NFT in Decentraland so I clicked on it it automatically put one on my parcel here highlighted in yellow we'll zoom in a little bit it's really small just to start but you'll see the information you have to put in is the NFT ID the contract uh, you can change the frame style to however you want the look to be and the background color. And I can't scroll all the way down, but I mean that's pretty much the two inputs here will bring in your NFT and then the rest will customize exactly how it looks. So there it is, it's already highlighted. What we can do is we can make it larger. This button here is scaling and it brings up these axes. Just gonna make sure I see it right. And I'll let you scale it in multiple directions here. All right, so there it is bigger. And then if you want to turn it, you can click on this button. These are the toggle orbits and you can grab the correct toggle Sounds a little difficult, there we go. And you can turn it, okay? And then the last uh, button up here is the toggle arrows. And that's where you can do stuff like make it higher. I can put it on the roof if I want up here. Let's just put it up there, out of the way from things. Oop. Zoom out just a tad. Okay, so, and you can grab it, and you can drag it, and you can put it anywhere you want but uh, let me show you how you get your specific NFT in here so like I said over here it wants the NFT ID and it's not hard to figure out if I go to my rareable here I can click on any one of my NFTs just click on patches here and then up here in the web address where it says token slash everything after that is the contract until you get to the first whoops I went too far until you get to the first colon I went to the second colon uh, so up to right there you can copy control C you can go back into the builder and like I said this is the contract so I'm gonna put the contract on this second line here, NFT contract, the token ID is much smaller as you can see. So let's go back and get that. So after the first colon, which the first colon is right here, you have a few digits. So you reach another colon. And right there in between the two colons is your token ID, control C to copy. The rest of this is just the owner's address, but you don't have to worry about that. You just need to know those first two for what we're doing. Uh, go back in here, highlight all this, control V to paste. So now it knows the contract and the token ID. Oh, at the bottom here, I know it says extra something. It thinks it says extra note. So you can type something like I can write patches. So I can remember that this one's patches when I'm moving around in my scene since I can't actually see it yet. And actually I know this one right here it's already in my scene is patches so watch if I click it it's still gonna say patches yeah see I still has, says patches over here even though I'm blocking part of the name and then this one I know is 9,000 so I click on him yep I wrote 9,000 
think this one's bubble. Yep, it says bubble over here. So that's how you remember which one's which since they don't show it to you until you jump in. And you know, that's, that's pretty much that. I mean, it's simple, but it's definitely something that I wanted to do right away. I want to show off my NFTs in Decentraland. It's really cool, it just looks like pieces of art. I'm gonna hit delete, delete this one that I put in there as the example. And uh, yeah, that's all there is to it. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, little tutorial on displaying your NFTs in Decentraland. And leave a comment and let me know if uh, you've got a parcel of land somewhere and you're showing off your NFTs and I'll check it out.